Vi do tre indizi, è un playmaker di nazionalità tedesca e campione del mondo in carica. Avete già capito di chi sto parlando e non ha bisogno di ulteriori presentazioni. Io sono Alessandra Tropiano e questo è Nice to Meet con Maodolo. Al termine dell'esperienza americana, Maodolo ha giocato per ben sette stagioni consecutive in Eurolega, due al Bamberg, due al Bayern e tre all'Alba Berlino. So today I'm in Milan with a new entry, Maudolo. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you as well. So I want to ask you the first impact with the city, with the team, but also with the country. This is the first time in for you. Yeah, uh, so it's the first time that I play outside of Germany. Um, and I'm here in Italy, so I'm, I'm very happy because uh, the food is great, uh, the yeah. city is great, Milano. <laughs> um, you know, there's a lot to see, a lot to do. Uh, there's nice architecture, nice shops, nice restaurants. So um, it's, it's a nice place to be in. What about the team? Uh, I'm happy to be here, uh, to be part of the team. Um, you know, there's great talent, there's a lot of experience on the floor, so, you know, I'm happy to, to, to be amongst, you know, good, good players. Maybe this is the right time for you because Milan show interest in you different times. Uh, you left Germany after many years, so this is the right moment. Yeah, I agree. Um, you know, I've, I've had my experiences in Germany and, um, you know, uh, played in great organizations and won championships, so. You know, I thought it was time for something different and this was the right time. How much is important in basketball career to catch the right moment for a player? Uh, it's extremely important. Um, you know, it can, can help careers and it can also sometimes uh, not help careers uh, depending on where you land and the right situation and, um, you know, timing is sometimes a very important element in, in, in the career of a player. Now we jump to the past because your first approach with basketball was through a video game. Yes. This is correct. It's correct. Can you tell me more? Um, yeah, it was a video game that my brother used to play and at the beginning of the game uh, they played a melody and I really enjoyed the sound of the melody. So nice. then I associated, you know, Okay, what game is this? And it was basketball, so then I thought, okay, let me try basketball. That's, okay. that's, how, that's how I started playing. Then you studied in Columbia University that is famous, it's not so famous for its basketball program, but gives you also a strong academic preparation. Yeah. So how much is important also for a player to have a plan B in life? Uh, I think I would advise every young player to, to make sure to have a plan B and to make sure you educate yourself, you, you get an education because um, Rarely life is guaranteed, you never know what's going to happen in the future, you never know if you're going to make it as a professional, you never know if you're going to stay healthy, so it's always, I would say, wise to have a, to have a second plan and it's always also good to educate yourself because life is not always just one-sided, there's many aspects to life and there's a lot to, a lot to learn and a lot to know. So for now, I don't think you need a plan B, you are world champion, so yeah. uh, what was the best memories of this amazing experience with Germany? Um, I think just the companionship and the atmosphere we had in the team. Um, we all got along, we're all uh, joking with each other and having good times and uh, to be successful in, in, in playing with your friends is, is just a special situation. So we go back to Bamberg time because you already played with Nicolò Melli. So how it feels to be back again with him after a long time? Uh, familiar. Um, so, like you said, I played with him together, especially it's my first year as a professional. So, you know, the first year is always a special year because you have to adjust and you have to, you know, learn, learn the new ways of being a professional basketball player. And, um, you know, he was, a, he was a big, big time member of the team in Bamberg. So, um, I'm very familiar with him now, playing with him. And he's still the same guy, still makes the same jokes. Uh, so, it's, uh, it's, it's fun to, to, to be his teammate again. Okay, so let's talk now about family because your mom is an artist, uh, his masterpieces are uh, all around the world. So, in some way, also art uh, is part of your life? Yeah, for sure. Um, it's a big part of my life. You know, as a, as, a, as, a, as a kid, I used to travel along with my mother to exhibitions and to museums. And um, I myself like to look at art and enjoy looking at you know, different artists from all over the world. So I think it definitely has an influence on me. And maybe you bring her art on the court. Uh, hopefully, yeah, hopefully. Okay, yeah. so we see you on the court. Thank you so much for that. Thank now. you, thank you.